What's up guys, Nexus here playing Team Deathmatch on Karachi, Modern Warfare 2, AA-12, and Vector. Uh, I'm doing a dual commentary with Drunken Rooster, aka, AKA Epic Team Just 14. Say hi to the crowd, Bradley. Hello. Okay. So Bradley, I wanted to ask you a couple questions today. What is your favorite Call of Duty? Modern Warfare 2 for the win. Why is it your favorite Call of Duty? Because that's my favorite sniper <laughs> What is that favorite sniper of yours? Intervention. Oh yeah. And I run, oh, I almost got killed by the Claymore. I almost got killed by a Claymore. <laughs> no, you didn't, you just got first blood. Eh, just kidding. So, man, oh, there we go, finally got him. So, uh, Bradley, what was your first Call of Duty you ever played? Ow. World at War. Do you like World at War? Yes, but there's way too many Yep, that is true. So, this game I kind of liked. Like, the only reason I liked this game was for the AA-12. And, uh, the rushing, probably. I love rushing. I'm just not one of those people that sit back, really, while playing this game. I, I think it's just kind of boring just sitting back. I kind of like just getting in the action. It's it's probably the funnest thing to do. Right now, just get in there and get get business done. Um, playing Search and Destroy the a couple maybe like an hour ago. I was doing really boss. Well, reload faster. I'm just kidding. Who's, whose fault is that? Okay. What are these guys at? They're just seriously all sitting somewhere. It's honestly getting on nerves. Two of them are sniping, so I can't really blend up. Okay, one of them's behind me. Shit, let me out of here. Oh, there he is. Oh, host rage. Uh, I'm hearing some little kids connect. Um, this was probably the first Call of Duty I actually got into. I played this game for so many hours and so many days. I played this every day after school. Now, this was just my number one Call of Duty right here. I, I just thought this Call of Duty was just so fun, but... You know, honestly, now it's not all as hyped up to be, you know. I just see a lot of people either trick shotting or just YouTubing. Just using, just taking advantage of this game pretty much. So there's just so much shit in this game. Yeah. See, there's the overpowered shotguns. There's the new tubes. There's the intervention trick shotting. There's, there's just, in danger close. Oh my god, that, that's just ridiculous. That, there's too many things to name about this game. But I'm not gonna bitch about it. Like when I was a kid, I really didn't even care about that stuff for some reason. I just kind of ignored it. But now, just like playing this game now and realizing how it was back, like back then, and still is today, it's just like wow. This is what this game is now. It's you know it's still probably going to always be my favorite Call of Duty, and my Call of Duty that I've had the most fun on, and the most laughs. And you know, this, this, I love Modern Warfare 2. Just, you know, the, you know, the AA-12 is not good at all on Modern Warfare 3. So I just came back to come come back to the good old AA-12 of Modern Warfare 2. And my, probably one of my favorite submachine guns, the Vector. Yeah. Favorite stuff to use back then. Just, I just love to play around with guns like this, you know, because it's, it's a lot of fun. And in Call of Duty, I tried to make the best out of it. I always try to do... Oh, I just got raped. Right. What does this guy think he's going? Okay. Let's see where these guys... See, they're all sniping pretty much. I'm doing okay right now. I should have 
probably put on scavenger. That's probably why I'm resorting to my vector most of the time. I'm almost out of ammo again. Oh man, I should have reloaded before I even went in there to those guys. Yeah, uh, this game, you know, I don't even know what to say about it. I, besides, you know, all that stuff I was saying, I, this game is just perfect. Really. This game is just the Call of Duty for me, you know. This, uh, this and World at War were definitely the two most Call of Duties that I played. Uh, World at War was kind of got what got me into Call of Duty. You know, World at War was a lot of fun too. And can't really get these. Yeah. Right. yeah, World at War before it got all hacked, that was pretty awesome. Yeah, I love World at War because I just this just the just the feel of World at War, which just made it like what it is. Honestly, I don't know what it was about that game, but uh, it was just pretty awesome. Proud that you're still there. So all the other Call of Duty's, they should have added co-op campaign to all the other ones. Yeah, that would have been nice. Special Ops, you know, it wasn't as made up. It wasn't as hyped up as it was to be, because I don't, I never really liked Spec Ops on this game. I love Survival and Modern Warfare 3, but, you know, there was just no good Spec Ops in this game, really. Oh, it's flashing I get flashed by. Oh shit. They're in front of me, so I'm fucked. Um, Bradley, what are your problems with this game? Yeah, the antenna is just overpowered as hell. That's like. The only shotgun that I actually had a problem with. I didn't really have a problem with any of the other shotguns really, except for the antenna. How is this guy not dying? Thank you for whoever killed him, because he was not dying. And I just, I kind of want to get back in the flow in this game. It's just a, this game is just... It's it's really fun. I've had a lot more fun on this than I ever had on like Modern Warfare 3. Because Modern Warfare 3 just makes me rage harder than ever. Honestly. I don't know. I kind of wish I could get over that game. And just kind of get back to the older Call of Duties. Honestly, I'm not looking... I kind of am, but... You know, Black Ops 2. You know, I'm kind of iffy on how it looks so far. But, you know... I've pretty much enjoyed every Call of Duty I played, so I can't really complain. Every Call of Duty for me has its ups and its downs. But you know, there's always that stuff in some game. Can't really say much. As this game comes to a close, by the Predator missile, I go 23 and 6. I'm not going to. You did fine, but it's okay. You don't. We never play this game anymore, so I can't. Remember. But and at 23 and 6, pretty good game for me. A12 and the Vector, probably my favorite combination. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be bringing you some more Call of Duty later. All right, see you all later.